Stephanie reacts to My Hero Academia. Well, this is season five, episode ten. That is that which is inherited. Yeah, at the end of last week, we saw Midoriya's match just about to begin. He says he'll go out to be the bait. And his friend says, "What about your quirk? Is it no like jump out of order kind of thing?" Do know? He says he'll be all right. So. We're getting into his match and getting him to get hypnotised over that and see past Beatrice's like which is hurted like his he's has his hurted into him so if I'm guessing I'll, I'll be like so I'm excited for this see if this is gonna be a two part or something like the match won't end at the end of this episode I'll continue on to the next episode kind of thing or it's gonna end with one episode. That's what we're here to see. Will they jump in? Yes, and we'll see. Starting now. Is to pull off an overwhelming win in the fourth round thanks to clever teamwork that focused on Kachan's like raw power. They went this one. So, that's a winning so far. It's now time for the fifth and final dream match. This one's for yep. all the glory. Are you exactly. ready? Do your best until the last student's down. The evil. Take Gigantomachia. He's our prisoner's direct subordinate, right? It's not just Shigaraki and the League of Villains who serve all for one. We don't know how many sympathizers he may have hiding in the world. So right now, we need to make sure we don't accidentally provoke any of them. I do apologize for any undue trouble. It's just that the memories are causing my body to throb with pain. He stared me straight in the eyes before saying this. The time has not yet come. Far as I can think, that's the only time she ever mentioned it. Thank you for telling me. How did you get him to talk to you? I didn't know what would provoke him, so I insulted his classmate. Hmm. In order for us to become heroes one day, we must sometimes act in less than heroic ways. If we don't, we can't stand alongside those with more power. When you consider Midoriya's team, the distribution of power is comparable to that of the last round. Yeah, our team did have a similar spread, but they don't have a ch- After seeing the insufferable win Bakugo pulled off, we obviously have our sights set on you this round. Anyone with an ounce of cleverness would want to be careful of someone who's not only strong, but incredibly agile. But isn't that too obvious? Someone even wiser might choose a different route. After all... Bakugo was only successful because he was backed up by his other three teams. Three against four. Will your friends hold their own? Shinso's lurking around so they won't be able to communicate freely. I'd hurry and go to them if I were you. They likely need help. Wait, hold on. Class B, right. Yui Kodai. Hero name, rule, quirk, right, right. size. She can that. Good for all. Get it together. I don't want to make anyone else worry about Again? 
Yeah. But you mean Crap, me. kid! You got it wrong! Dang it! Didn't we? Feels like my time's running out. That was fast. One more thing, kid. The power you just shot out of you was originally right. my quirk. Maybe I should explain a bit. Our individual quirk factors mixed in with the core of one for all. They've been inside of you this whole time. Now, imagine this core over your emotions as well. After being passed down through eight people, one for all has become an awesome force. Prepare yourself. You'll have six more quirks manifest as you improve. Control your heart and master using those. <laughs> the dark stuff that came out of him went crazy and ruined our strategy. Nice timing, you guys. Are you okay? What was that just now? My... There they are, Troy and God's dead! Victoria, Uraraka, you okay? What do you think, Eraser? <sighs> All right. <sighs> Let's wait. Let's see what happens. What? But I saw what? This is far from over. The match continues. Here's the preview! One for all suddenly went out of control. It's dangerous to keep using my quirk. But I don't want to give up on this match. Shinso, Monoma, and the others feel the same way. So we'll keep fighting with all of our strength. For our teammates, and for victory. Next time! Our brawl! The important thing is to always remember where yeah. you came from! Go beyond! Ultra. Plus Ultra! Well everyone, that is that which is inherited. Wow, that was a good episode it was. Oh. As I've said a lot of times, if they're in the programme, if they're action, like fighting and all that, I enjoy that kind of stuff. It's interesting to watch. But if nothing's happening, it gets boring. There's only like a wee side episode. But this, wow. We got to meet one of the veterans. I don't think we got a name from him, I don't think. If we did, I don't know if I got his name. But Midoriya's quirk went out of order. And he was thrown these like, no, oh, vines. These electricity stuff <coughs> out. He was. And... You can just control it, you can just stop it or anything. I'm guessing it's like Dark Shadow. As soon as that hits dark, that goes out of control. But with this Midoriya, why don't you keep getting angry? Because you he heard him talking about All Might. Talking about his school friends, aye, maybe. But then he talked about All Might, how he's not the number one hero anymore and that. Midoriya just snapped. That's when he's. Let's see things from his arms. Oh, and it was more of my got him to do it. And it was, so your Raka came up with an idea to get Shinzo to hypnotize Midoriya to stop the clerk. Cause off, no, off my job. All my Mr. Zawa were going to stop the match cause they all my asked him to. Then this is his clerk's out of order. You have to stop it now. So that's what they were going to do. But you and I can come up with a plan. To get Shinzo to hypnotise him. So that was a good thing to do. And I knew he probably had to be hypnotised. But no this way, didn't he? I thought he may have to be hypnotised seeing the other vertices again. But you got to see one. But we learned on it. He can, he can learn all multiple quirks. From season, from season one, a wee boy with no quirk at all, to season five, a guy can learn multiple quirks. Oof. He's got his aim wee quirk now, like all for one kind of thing. But he's learned to adjust that with his gauntlets and his boots, and that means his own power. But then that other veteran geese guy we saw, I think he called it Black Whip or something he says. The other day is his quirk it was. We think a rage can be a powerful quirk. It could be powerful. But don't don't forget to use that, your heart. He says. 
you don't use if you go to rage or somebody, use it. But use your heart to control the quirk. You don't want to go out of control. But <coughs> then he says to Midoriya, you've got six more quirks to learn, or or make it come out of you. Oh, I'm seeing like ages ago, hey, but all might like flying and all that swooping. So maybe Midoriya will get learn to fly, hey then. Maybe. So I don't know if that's Omi's quirk or no, or if that's somebody else he inherited then also. So after this, I don't know if this is going to continue for the, uh, his next episode, I. I don't know if it's going to continue till two episodes or that, or how long this match is going to last. So I don't know if Midori will learn all the other quirks in this one battle, or if he'll learn it all through maybe the whole season then. Oh, but Midori tried to take the lead at his bait, and he can he talk, and his pals can he talk either, like you, <coughs> that's how we've seen that, pointing to them, like you go there, he go there, because he knows if they talk, Shinzo can get to them, or Motoma can get to them, by you copying Shinzo's quirk. But we did see, as you know, I'm no good with names, you just see like, one of the guys <coughs> using Quirk twice. I forget what that's called. Ah, pig. So using the quirk, then using it again for the second time. I'll get to see what it's called. Is this a year maybe? No, no it's before that. Very much cost that. I can see it coming up. Ah, he saw you, didn't he? No, I forget what it's called, but man, he caused the battle to happen twice in this thing. I don't like to move my camera, my camera's in the way the cursor so I can't see. But if I move the camera, aye. But you know what I'm talking about anyway. That was a good quirk of his. I know the word, I can see it. But I just can't get it out, I can't. Eh? That's a devil. I hate it when that happens. You know what it is, but you can't get it out. Oh. That's hard, that's bad when I've got that mind block. It's called, I think it is. Well, you can get it in games too. That can do no work, work, but that can do power. You can do two things at the same time. It's more like a gyro thing, isn't it? The gyro bullets, whatever it is. You know what I'm talking about anyway. But that was a good quirk. And the size one too. That last we had. That's why if they fire wee, wee things at them, you'll see the wee things coming. So you can make them grow straight away and knock them out of that. They could. But with your Arrakis power, she just tapped them. I mean, them float. So that's what alright. That's what an alright quirk it was there. And they had a wee bit of you or Akas backstory a wee bit. We did. Oof. You see now, like how when she saw her mum and dad and all that. It's like her mum and dad were sad and some stuff. So she got a wee bit sad, like they were no sad, they were tired, she says. So she got that, but as soon as she saw her first hero, that's when she knew she wanted to help people and stuff. And so she seen her tapping on an old woman and people were helping her up. So that's good, wasn't it? The next episode, I know we've got, I don't know, we've got to continue the fight. It's called Our Brawl. So if it's Our Brawl, Monoma and Midoriya, or Shinzo Midoriya maybe, our brawl means, probably means like Cathy and Cathy Bray came together, our brawl, or it could be like you versus me, a one on one, our brawl. But, I hope that you know, next episode does not finish the battle off. I hope it lasts to episode 12, I hope.
Because this is what will turn out to be a good and excellent match, it would. But to be a draw, Class B has to win. So Class A wins first, Class B wins two, three, it was a draw, four, Class A wins. So Class B has to win, then it'll be a draw. But, ah, no, Class B has to win. And then it will be a draw, aye, 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 aye. But, <coughs> If Class A wins, they win. No way, can't, you can't even get a draw, can they? No, but they can make a draw. I'm talking about if Class B wins, then that's a draw that way, aye. But you can't end the match on a draw. Like your hands with match three. You can't do that way, you can't. If you do that, then Class A wins. Because they've still got. The one point up. So Class B has to win today. But, yeah, that'll be from either episode 12 or episode 13 or 14. Depends how long this match with Midoriya continues. Actually, no. I'm thinking about six matches. This is the last match, isn't it? But anyway, you know what I mean. So, anyway, everyone. <laughs> Sorry for my wee ramble, but thank you for watching this reaction. Hit the like button, comment down below, and have a good day, good night, good week, good weekend. Stay safe out there everyone, I'll see you in the next one. Bye lovelies.